Dear friends, today's video I prepared only for my students who are opted for operation research this time. Because when operation research topic come into picture, everyone is big, bit panicked that it is a too tough to understand. So I like to prepare some of the videos by which it is easier for the students and simultaneously it is easier for me when I will teach the same subject in the next year. Before starting that, I like to highlight the some of the basic concept in the context of the operation research. The concept lies in between. Whenever any type of the organization is, there are two prime objective. One, to increase the revenue and the profit. And second, you have to reduce the cost. And simultaneously, everyone should remember how to optimize the resources. Because when resources are surplus, then there will be no issue to think about to reduce the cost or increase the revenue. Maximize the resources is the good one, but it is not the sustainable model. You all know that when subsidized urea we have used for our own agricultural practices, what the fate of soil has been observed in current days. So optimize the utilization of the resources is the important one to achieve our current objectives. It may be increase the revenue or decrease the cost. But whenever you are planning to achieve your objective, you are facing some of the alternative course of action. Just I'm giving an example. Suppose students will leave the hostels and think to come to the class, they have numbers of choice, choices. They will go with their friend's vehicle or bike. They may come with bare foot or they come through the walking process or they have combination of both. They come with the walking and after that in between they use the uh, use the bike of the, the friends or to take the lift and come to the college. When numbers of alternative course of actions are coming into picture, then outcome becomes they may be late, they may be too much early, they may be, may be on time, but according to the choices, you have to choose which is the best one. Whenever you have ample of time, you come, come to the college by walking, when, whenever you have no time, you choose the bikes to come to the college. Whenever alternative course of actions are there, then different type of the outcome also be observed or you have to pay off in the context of the benefit or the loss. So operation research take into consideration different type of the objectives. You have to be very clear that what should be your objectives. If I like to know this particular model, then which objectives I have to put forth. If I thinking about the transportation model, my objective should be minimize the cost. If I, I am thinking the waiting line model, my objective is the how to reduce the time in the queue. If my objective is the sequencing model, my, obje my objective should be that my overall uh, machinery should be properly balanced and there should be very less slack time in between the machines. Accordingly, you have to plan. When there is clear cut objectives, then you have to come across different type of the alternative course of action. And you have to choose the best course of the actions by which you can manage or optimize the utilization of the resources. If your alternative course of actions are different, you could not choose that, then you your organization could not achieve the efficiency in the current era of computations. And whenever operation research, you have to go through the different type of the models. Models means it is time centric place centric and there should be definite assumption to run a particular model. Suppose there is a model that model should do better in a confined environment, then your assumption should be that particular environment, particular moisture percentage, particular temperature should be needed to keep the potato in the cold storage. To violate that, you could not achieve the efficiency or efficacy of the particular model. Why such type of the things are coming to picture in current days? Because whenever 
there are numbers of choices decision making is bit difficult when there will be only one choice you could, you could not take any decisions that you have to accept the choices but whenever numbers of choices are there then you choose the best one and management come into picture when there are more number of the choices and good manager can take the good decisions that is all about the prime phase of the operation research in very few course few very few time i will bring numbers of models that come into picture in the line of operation research be tuned with me definitely you will be benefit by subscribing my youtube channel and definitely you will conserve more time by going through this type of the videos thank you all thank you watching my video